like I'm a big God of War uh, person, and uh, I was playing the game, and it sounds like kind of ridiculous, but um, uh, the main character, like his name's Kratos or whatever, you're playing, and he's like, he has a son in the game, and he was just telling his son, he was like, um, even good leaders make poor choices, the best of them take responsibility. I was playing it like while I was going through like the whole surgery process and everything. It really like resonated with me. Like you, in, in life you make choices and you know, it's your responsibility to, you know, uh, to set them right. Good, um, the weekend was good. No pain? Mm -hmm. Good, like was it sore out on Friday? Um, like a little bit, but uh, leg, like my quad. Some exercises. Hmm? Some exercises. Yeah, I did want to play as soon as I got here. Um, and that was a conversation me and Coach Long had. And the conversation was like, we'll play you, like if you know what you're doing, and like if you can play. So like preseason was just like a matter of like showing everyone I could play, and like I knew what I was doing. Some guys had gotten hurt, so they were down a guy. So then I, I stepped in and, and, and filled that role as a rotation player. You gotta take uh, little steps every day. Um, and then that leads to, you know, the big strides uh, later on. Uh, I kind of try to think of it as a roller coaster. Um, you know, you're slowly like, getting better, getting better, getting better, and then it's going to be to a point where like all that work you put in is going to let you just flow down and and uh, like you'll see all the work pay off. Wildcats, ranked 21st in the nation, are ready to take on the Buckeyes of the Ohio State University. Playing against Ohio State, it meant a lot, uh, just being from Cincinnati. Um, and a lot of people I knew were on the team. So, you know, it was a game, you know, something to prove. The Big Ten or like all Big Ten rankings that like came out then, I like didn't make the, in any of the lists. And uh, I think in one of the pictures, you can see that I wrote like all Big Ten um, on one of my um, wrists that I taped just for like extra motivation. Yeah, so it was just something to prove like as a person, as a whole team, um, as a school, I was running on the field, and I just want I looked around, and I just tried to take everything in, um, like the crowd, um, the players, just the atmosphere in general. And I got like tabletop uh, sort of deal, and uh, my knee just didn't feel right. Um, and then, you know, it's a Big Ten championship game, so like I'm not gonna stop playing. Um, so, uh, finish the game. Um, and then the day after, um, go to the trainers, they look at it, you know, I said, go back to uh, the facility. I think we were off for like a couple of days. Um, just really rested it. At that time we were like going through uh, practice. Um, it was like a dead, dead period. I went to get an MRI, looked at it with a doctor. I had um, two, had two tears. After that, I, I practiced on it for about a week, every practice, I couldn't move how I wanted to. Oh. Oh. That was good. good. I was feeling it towards the end. Good. Let's stick with two legs for this one. Okay. You know, parents, you know, they want their 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 kid to be safe. Um, they wanted me to get um, get it fixed. Me, like, I love playing football, so like, I was thinking about just, you know, just keep playing on it. But, you know, after practicing for a week, week and a half, and it hurting, <laughs> I tried to, you know, just take a step back and really think about what would be best moving forward and, like, in line with my goals. I want to play in the NFL, and, and you know, you can't do that limping around and everything. Let's go in five, like five seconds. Oh, you tell me when. Okay. <laughs> Take your time. Five. <laughs> you know, uh, you never want to want to miss time, whatever you're doing. But, you know, I, I feel, though, as I, you know, like I have, I have the skills, I have the talent, I have the, the willingness to, like, put in the work to play at the next level.
so it just made sense to make sure I'm all right um, when I do make that, that next step. It was definitely a hard decision. Um, yeah. Especially in, in this point of my life, um, not really knowing what's going to happen, um, good, bad, or indifferent. We're all training because, you know, we have dreams and aspirations. We're all working for that that one thing while we're doing it. It's just like, it's something special.